super easy disembarkation. All the suitcases were back over here in the corner. And with our tag, which was a black, they already took that off as we took our suitcase. We were black, which means all the independent transfers. And right now we're waiting for our driver, Mr. Song, from Mr. Orange Transportation. By the way, don't believe Viking or any other ship when they say, oh, there won't be any transport available outside the terminal. There are plenty of taxi drivers just waiting to take you into Beijing or wherever you want to go. Also, um, Viking told me when I called them about using their transfer, they said, oh, no, no, you can't. And then, of course, we get on the ship and they're more than happy to transfer you into Beijing or the airport. But we're paying 180 US dollars. The ship wants 250. Check it all out. And here's our transportation right on time, just as we said. I suggest you use them. Got a nice car. Mm hmm. Very nice car. As you can see, it's raining outside. It's our first day of rain in like 15 days. And we're making our way into Beijing. There was absolutely no traffic till we got to here, heading east on the fourth ring road. Beijing is 25 million people and I think nine million cars. And we are here. We've stayed at this JW Marriott twice, at least twice before. Great hotel, great location. Oh, okay, yes, here? yes, <laughs> yes. That's it.